Hey guys, so we are going to talk about a topic we have not talked about in some time. Yes, Tolarian Community College. So where to begin? Well, he posted a video and the video was a really funny video. I did enjoy the video and now someone has re-uploaded the video. I guess people found the video offensive. So he posted a video after, I assume, a few less than an hour, It was the video was taken down. Now the video also has marrow in it. So it, it was pretty interesting. Um, not much to say about the video. You do have to watch the video on uh, someone that's re-uploaded the video. I will have uh, that channel and the name of the video. But it was a funny joke about thickness and the thickness of the sleeves that uh, he was using. I didn't find the video very offensive. I thought the video was, uh, the video was titled Extreme Thickness and it was basically um, a combination of funny jokes that are not appropriate for kids and the thickness of the sleeve. I pretty much laughed out loud when Merrill came in and was shaking his head as if to uh, chide Tolarian Community College, Brian. But like that, this type of video, why, why does it get taken down? Like who told him to take it down? Was it Magic the Gathering? Was it Merrill himself? I think there's a lot of really I don't know. It's like it's kind of like not fun anymore that the video content you have to be very PR. Uh, and if you want to be an MPL member or you want to be sponsored, you have to be just so PR, which doesn't make too much sense to me because Magic used to be a place of really funny memes, really interesting stuff. And then ever since people got banned, banned for memes and being in the Magic for Worse Facebook group, the entire Facebook group got banned, uh, then the memes have gotten really less funny. And I think that's disappointing. That's quite disappointing in my opinion because, like, why can't we have good memes? Like, every other group has great memes. We just are stuck with... I don't know what we're stuck with, but it's not cool. I think when it comes down to Tolarian Community College, he should have every right to make a funny video about a meme. Like who's, why would you tell him not to do that? Like it doesn't make any sense. Like he wants to make his funny memes, let him make his funny memes and his video so his video wasn't that bad like compared to my videos or some of the videos that other people have posted i thought it was a pretty interesting and smartly created video and he's talking about the thickness of a card sleeve so it does make sense uh, so it's not like so inappropriate that it's bad right I vaguely recall waking up early in this morning and watching a new upload from the professor titled something like Extreme Thickness. It seemed to be a remix of his card sleeve reviews with clips looped in suggestive ways as professor talks about thickness. Thing is, I cannot find any evidence or mention of this video anywhere and since I was barely awake when I watched it, I'm starting to wonder if it was all some sort of weird fever dream. Did anyone else see this? In my opinion, the video was not even that offensive. It was just a funny video. And they took it out of context and they, somebody took it out of context and got offended. I mean, it's surprising the number of people who get offended over simple things in Magic the Gathering. But nonetheless, someone got offended and then the Professor had to take down the video, which I think is not cool. So back to my original assessment and, you know, let's just say, let's call it what it is, okay? These MPL members and these officially sponsored, anyone who receives a card to spoil, they're under a very tight leash. Like they are under a very, very tight leash. 
of what they can and what they cannot do. And the funny, the crazy part is someone wanted to post a, you know, the professor of all things who has more YouTube followers than every other magic YouTuber wants to post a funny video about the thickness of sleeves in kind of a non-child related way. And it's a one minute video. It was really funny. Mero was in the video giving his you know, nod. And then bam, it was taken down. And it was taken down so fast that people who watched the video don't know if uh, it was real or not. It was also deleted from Twitter and things because it gets auto-loaded in Twitter. It's pretty out there. Like, I, I, I don't know. It's, it's pretty out there. I think when it comes down to Magic the Gathering today, there is a lot of people who don't want to have fun in it. They just want to get offended. And I do understand that, you know, some things are actually offensive, right? But here, I just don't feel it. I just don't see what the point is, to be quite honest. I I don't understand um, what there is to be offended by. This is a funny video he made about the thickness of card sleeves and also, you know, the extreme thickness of, you know, some magic players, I guess. But, like, that's... Okay, so back to the reason that I'm making this video. I totally forgot. Uh, this reminds me a lot of what happened to the Facebook group that Wu ran. Is somebody posted a meme of nine female slash non-binary magic players and wanted to rate them on hotness. And then that was called offensive. And then everyone in the Facebook group got bad. One funny dude went to Grand Prix Richmond and took pictures of people's butt cracks. That was too offensive and again he got banned so it's like what's going on so if tolerant community college posts a funny rap video about the thickness of a car that he's sp it clearly spent time editing it and he clearly did want to post it because it was posted on his channel and immediately he had to take it down to the point that people don't even know if it was a dream if it all was a dream is this really Magic the Gathering? You no, know, in every other group I'm in, Fate Grand Order, I, I play FGO, Fire Emblem, there's a lot of funny memes. And it's not meant to like offend people, it's just meant to be like, oh, that's a funny meme. So I think people in Magic the Gathering are too entitled. That's the word I would put. They feel like they're really important and they get offended by everything very easily, even by their favorite Magic the Gathering. It just doesn't make any sense. Like, I, I don't understand. I don't want to understand. But it would be nice to have great memes back. Or even to make this funny video about Tolerant Community College. I don't see why he had to censor himself and or was censored by someone else. It seems quite silly. In my opinion, I it just doesn't make any sense. Like, he should... You know, he should He should be able to make this type of video and not feel threatened by people who don't like this type of stuff. It was a funny video. It was a very well done video and it kind of you know, I laughed pretty hard, especially like the marrow part. I enjoyed the video and it was just a one minute funny video. And that just shows you how tightly wound everyone in this community is that we can't enjoy a a video like this you know i i don't know what to say except there are some youtube channels and fake grand order their entire purpose to exist is funny memes and tolerant community college he didn't attack anyone else uh Mer Mero's part was just kind of funny he was making fun of himself. He was self-effacing. I don't see who it harms. Now, one of the questions might be um, demonetization. I don't think so because we got actually determined our own monetization now. It was a great laugh. It was hilarious. But 
maybe it was um, not a good way to promote his channel. But in that case, why can't you just have a video like that? Like, why does ha everything have to be on brand? Why does everything have to be basically a mask, right? If you enjoyed the video, and I think Tulane Community College obviously did because he probably spent a lot of time editing the video, then, and you post the video, you weren't ashamed of the video at that time, why delete the video? Because Wizard Coast told you to? Weird. Anyway, bye guys.